lady. Why aren't you in your dress? Uh, number 11. You're in the first group. <gasps> Is that a hair on your lip? I hope so. We'll just pull that right out. No! <laughs> Come on, that's my only one. Thank you, Tiffany. Our modeling competition continues, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome number 11, Miss Tyresha Jones. Tyresha enjoys marine biology double dutch, and her hero is George Washington. Carver. He's out of his mind! Two thousand dollars? He's a genius! Yay, Tyresha! You go, girl! Sure, no one noticed you trip. <laughs> and Rebecca, your dress is so darling. It's just long enough to hide your scrawny little chicken legs. Hey, back off, Merle! <laughs> I, uh, I mean, why, why can't we all just be nice to each other? You are new. Wait until Maddie sees me in this tux. She'll realize age is just a number, and we'll no longer have to hide our love. Oh, please. Do you realize how ridiculous you're being? Me? Have you looked in the mirror lately? <laughs> this is the traditional costume of La Mima. It also happens to be the traditional costume of La Dork. <laughs> wow. You look... Wow. You look pretty wow well yourself. <laughs> and you look... Whoa. <laughs> hey, thanks again for helping out with the prom. I just want everything to be perfect. It will be. Hey, Maurice! <laughs> I've decided to take a vow of silence just like you. I mean, let me tell you, it's not easy. It's only been about two minutes, and I'm having a real tough time with it. But you, 30 years, you're my hero. How do you do it? I mean, don't you ever get frustrated? And how do you order takeout? And I bet your phone bill is like zero. <laughs> hey, come back! Untie me! He's good. Cody, check in. In where? In the game. I can't go out there. They're playing. I know. I need you to go in for your brother. You couldn't possibly play any worse than he is. Just watch me. Better, honey. Gotta go potty. Come on. I'm going in the game. I get to watch two uniforms tonight. You fake it to me and do it to tape work. Okay, play three. Cody, that's it, huh? Okay, get in here. All right, Zach, Cody's hurt, and we need you back in the game. Rushing to biology. Afraid all the good frogs will be taken? 
I don't want to run into Agnes. We were buddied up on a field trip to the planetarium, and she wouldn't let go of my hand all day. I mean, you look at Saturn's rings once with a girl, and she thinks you're engaged. <laughs> don't sweat it. Agnes's locker is at the other end of the school. Oh, hey, Agnes. Ah! <laughs> That's not funny. Why, oh, why was I cursed with these devastating good looks? Imagine how hard it is to be the handsome twin. Hey, Agnes. I'm not falling for that again. Hi, Cody. Ah! Hey, Agnes. Cody was just talking about you. You were talking about me? Yes. I mean, no. I mean, gotta go. Wait! Look what I did in our class. To you and me sitting on Saturn's rings. Well, that is so weird. But I worked really hard on it. Yes, and it shows. I knew you'd appreciate it. Wait till you see the one of us on top of our wedding cake. <laughs> Where'd he go? I'm not telling you. Five bucks. Biology. <laughs> friends, Bob, Warren, and Jeremy. I'll see if I can find them. Where could they be hiding? It's a closet. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> Whoa. Would you like a juice spritzer? It's banapple. <laughs> it's simply delicious. Cheers. Cheers. Would you get that? Hi. I'm here to measure for the wall-to-wall uh, -wall carpeting. Come on in. Hold this. Excuse me, guys. Oh. Coming through. Oh. Excuse me. Oh. Isn't this awesome? It's like a little house. It's elegant, yet casual. It's sophisticated, yet tasteful. I think it's stupid, yet stupid. I'm here to make up the bed. Perfect. Let me do it in the bedroom. Excuse me. Whoa. Coming through. Sorry. Watch out. Yeah. Oh. I'm here to clean up. You come here often? Delivery. Of course. Sorry. I have a big screen TV for uh, Cody Martin. Great! It goes to the den right this way. Whoa! Coming through. Get out of the way. Come on, move it. Move it or loose it. We're coming in. Come I'd on. like to hang it up right about here. And how could you afford all this? some wise investments with my allowance while others invested in gum. Most of which is still on the floor of our... Excuse me, you're a room. Okay, so my room's a little messy. A little? Your room smells like toe jam. On a hot day. Come in. Join the party. Oh, excuse me. Hi. And did someone order a massage? Oh, over here. Right here. Yeah, yeah I'm all not it up. Yeah, yeah, I'll come to you. Ooh, This is the You were saying? People, you're in a closet. What more can you do in here? Room service. I should have known. <laughs> Pretty cool. Wow, Cody, you Excuse really know me? how to throw a great party. Guys, would you rather be in a six foot by six foot closet? Actually, it's a six and a half by six and three quarters. Like it makes a difference. <laughs> Don't be afraid to really dig in. Oh, <laughs> Love the dipping sauces. Is that coconut? Who cares? Would you guys rather stay in a tiny, airless room packed with a million people than hang out in my room? Yeah. You know what? Fine. I'm out of here. Excuse me. Pardon me. Trying to storm out. Making a dramatic exit. Not happening. <laughs> Party. Who has a party in a closet? Oh. Oh. 